Nowadays, our societies face many complex challenges. Across the world, governments, businesses, NGOs, knowledge institutions and civil society organizations work together to tackle these challenges. This is not only about global developments, such as climate change and growing inequality. On the level of cities and neighborhoods, we see many examples of cooperation between these actors. They attempt to address problems in local infrastructure, public space, housing and the environment. Think for example about the redesign of a neighborhood park, a square or a shopping district. Local universities can play an important role by providing knowledge through direct cooperation with residents, policymakers and business owners. This is also called community engagement. Welcome to the first video in this series of eight. This video series will discuss community engagement in design and planning education. We will explain the challenges that university instructors face when they try to achieve meaningful community engagement. But what exactly is community engagement? Bennerworth and colleagues define university community engagement as a process whereby universities engage with community stakeholders to undertake joint activities that can be mutually beneficial. These activities may include teaching, participatory action research, lifelong learning, volunteering of staff and students, service-based learning, cultural or educational events, and access to universities' buildings, for example by art groups. Students and their instructors can play an important role in these activities. Community engagement always includes collaboration between the involved actors. Preferably, this collaboration has a reciprocal nature. This means that all the involved actors should enjoy certain benefits. This video series explores the balancing act of engaging local communities and stakeholders in student research in university courses. Each video will deal with a different challenge. Community engagement is increasingly used in university education, particularly in the fields of architecture, planning and urban design. Remember the example I gave on the redesign of a public park. This process of redesign can be based on co-creation between students and local community members. Community engagement has strong potential benefits for students, university instructors, local communities and other stakeholders. But it is notoriously difficult to achieve effective community engagement. In this series, I will present an encompassing framework which helps to understand the main challenges and conditions for local community engagement in student research. Each of the six main challenges will be explained in one video. These six challenges are objectives of the interaction, specific interests and expected outcomes, problematization, prior knowledge and perspectives, responsiveness and flexibility, and finally, lead time of the course. The videos also offer some advice for course coordinators to deal with these challenges. Let's continue to the next video in which we discuss the differences in objectives of the interactions between students instructors and community members.